Hi, welcome to Bloom Bed and Breakfast. How can I help you today? Oh, great. And did you have a reservation with us? Fantastic. All right. Can I just get your name so I can look that up in my book? There you are. Wonderful. Okay. Now it looks like when you called in, um, we forgot to get some of your basic information. So is it all right if I get that from you right now? Wonderful. Okay. Let me just. Uh, this is our guest registry sheet. Right here. And. Uh, Rather than having you fill it out, I'll just go ahead and quickly fill it out for you. That way you can, uh, you don't have to worry about it. Okay, what's your address? Wonderful. And um, what's the best contact phone number? It's quite lovely outside, isn't it? Especially for this time of year. Yeah. Okay. And what kind of car are you driving, just so I know uh, to put it in the books here? Is it parked in the lot? Okay. Ford? Okay. And do you, uh... Yeah, do you happen to have a license plate number? Wonderful. Perfect. Yeah, we actually, um, just to make keep things safe, we always keep record of uh, our guests' vehicles. That way we know who's parking here and, um, yeah, just for safety reasons. I mean, we're in a beautiful part of the town, but uh, you never know. Looks like uh, we have marked here that you're going to be staying with us in our Garden View suite, is that correct? Yes, that is quite lovely. Uh, well, uh, this time of year, of course, all of the colors are changing, so from that room uh, you get a great view of the kind of seasonal trees that we have, so they're all kind of turning colors of amber and red and, and um, orange, so it's, it's amazing, yeah. Well, um, I'm just going to get a couple more uh, questions out of the way, and then I'm going to briefly just walk you through what you can expect during your stay here with us uh, this week. It's kind of a special week because it is Thanksgiving week, so you're in for a bit of a treat. <laughs> All right. So, um, can I get an emergency contact? Just their name and their phone number, please. Yeah. Are there any special dietary restrictions we should know about? Um, for instance, uh, do we need to prepare diabetic meals, gluten-free meals, vegan meals? Okay. Terrific. All right, well, that's, yeah, that's all there is to it. Um, like I said, you're staying here uh, during a special week because it's a holiday week, so... Uh, every night we're going to be, pre be preparing kind of rather special and unique meals compared to what we usually serve. Um, yes. Um, the night before Thanksgiving, Wednesday, we'll be serving a delicious shrimp scampi, or you can choose uh, our roasted chicken breast. And of course, it'll come with all the fixings and uh, a wonderful dessert. We have a variety of desserts you can choose from. 
uh, Thanksgiving Day itself. We'll be having a delicious full spread turkey meal. So we'll have, uh, we're baking three turkeys actually because we, we have a number of guests this week. And we'll also have, you know, the basic Thanksgiving side dishes. So we'll have um, some baked yams with marshmallows and brown sugar. And then we'll have some cornbread stuffing and that has a variety of wonderful things in it. Um, we'll also be making um, a few different vegetable side dishes, a green bean casserole of course, some fresh uh, homemade rolls, and for dessert we'll have three types of pie. We'll have pecan, pumpkin, and apple. <laughs> it does sound wonderful, doesn't it? Now that meal will be served at two. Uh, we tend to serve our meals a bit early uh, during Thanksgiving. But if you come down here at noon, we'll have a bunch of appetizers out for you and uh, yeah, things like um, crab stuffed mushrooms, a full olive platter with nice cheeses on it, and a variety of different things. And of course, we'll have a nice selection of wine and various other beverages, champagne, that sort of thing, yeah. Does that sound good? Okay. I know I'm looking forward to it. Okay, let me just make a few notes here. Um, and we said that you're in the garden view room, correct? Okay. Now it does look like we got all of the credit card information from you when you did call in, so I don't need any of that. Will you be using that same credit card to pay? Okay, great. We don't charge you until you leave, until you check out, so it's perfectly fine if you need to switch payment options at that point. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to walk you up there and kind of show you around the room just so you uh, have an idea of all the amenities there that, that are available to you. And uh, yeah, then you can enjoy your week. Okay? Okay. Wait just a moment. Let me go ahead and grab the key and then uh, we'll head on up there. It's on the second floor. Okay, and here's your room. Mm-hmm. Now, um, yeah, the floorboards are a bit creaky, so you'll have to watch out for this. This, this house was actually built at the turn of the century, so it's a bit old. The last century, not this one, of course. <laughs> yeah, okay, so, um, as you'll see here, this is the actual bedroom. This is a suite room, so you'll have a bedroom. And you have an ensuite bathroom, of course, and then you have a nice little sitting area over there. And if you go out those doors, that's the balcony that leads out to the garden view, and it's absolutely marvelous. You'll see that in a minute. It's, it's really fantastic. So uh, this room, it's a king-size bed, and uh, of course a high thread count on all the sheets. Mm -hmm. It's Egyptian cotton, so they're very soft and, uh, yeah. I'm sure you'll have a restful night's sleep here, definitely. So, mm -hmm. yeah, we have a little stationary area over there with a little writing desk, so if you need to write notes or memos or whatever the case may be, write out those postcards to people back home. Yeah, that's, that's all right there. Uh, we also have a few postcards available for you that are already stamped, so you can just uh, fill them out and send them off. I know. Not very many people send out postcards anymore, but I always enjoy receiving postcards, so I try to send them out whenever I can. And uh, we also have, if you'll notice, uh, on these shelves here we have a variety of relaxation aids. So we have a few lavender vanilla candles. And you'll also notice a couple sleep masks and some bath salts and that tape brings me to the bathroom, so we'll walk in here. Okay, and here's the bathroom. And as you can see, it's a jacuzzi-style tub. Yep, I told you you'd be needing those bath salts. And of course, a full shower as well. And um, You'll notice that all of our facilities, especially in these suite rooms, are really uh, quite luxurious and upgraded. 
try to do our best to make you as comfortable as possible. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you know, all of your toiletries are already here, so there's shampoo, conditioner. If you need anything else, though, feel free to call down to the front desk. Uh, there's a phone right there by the bed. Mm -hmm. And uh, just dial zero, and it'll dial down to the operator. And then uh, we'll go to the little sitting area room over here. Alright, now, as you see, this has a full couch. This couch also is a sleeper couch, so it pulls out, so if you do have any guests, uh, yeah, you can just have them stay here if you like. Um, actually, with our, uh, our turkey dinner on Thanksgiving, you are allowed up to two guests. Um, yeah, one guest per person, essentially. So since there are two of you, you're allowed two guests. So you can invite uh, anyone over that might be in the area. That's not a problem, and they're more than welcome to join us for dinner. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we like to extend that courtesy to our guests, definitely. So, um, yeah. That's pretty much it. And then we'll go actually head out to the balcony and I'll show you a little bit of that. Okay, and here's the balcony. As you can see, it's a rather spacious balcony. We already have a whole little dining area set up out there. So if you'd like to order room service or even bring your Thanksgiving meal back here and eat it out on the balcony, it is quite lovely. It's a little bit brisk in the evenings, around 5 or 6 o'clock, when the sun begins to go down. You'll notice it gets a bit chilly, so I do suggest bundling up if you go out there in the evenings. Mm -hmm. It's a lovely space, isn't it? Yeah, plenty of room. Okay, well, let's go back inside uh, the room itself, and I'll go ahead and... Um, go over just a few different amenities that are available in the bed and breakfast building uh, so that you can find out about those, okay? Okay. Alright, so aside from a wonderful room, you also have access to our library, which is downstairs on the first floor. In fact, it's right in the lobby, right by where you checked in. Mm-hmm. We have an impressive collection. We have over a thousand books, and they're all divided up by genre, you'll find. So, yeah, we kind of take pride in our library. And then outside, you'll notice there is a jacuzzi, um, a heated jacuzzi, and that is open 24 hours a day. So whatever time you'd like to enjoy that, you're more than welcome. And of course, we have our garden that you have the wonderful view from your room, too, and the garden. It's open to all of our guests. It is a private garden, so it's fenced off, so you won't have to worry about anybody uh, yeah, interrupting your privacy or your peace and quiet. So, um, yeah, the garden is about an acre large, so it's, it's a nice spacious garden, a lot of nice oak trees around, so, yeah. And then, as for the food, you can actually um, enjoy breakfast from 7 to 10 in the morning, Lunch will be served from 12 to 2, and then dinner is typically served from 5 to 8. Except, of course, on uh, Thanksgiving Day itself, we do have a bit of a modified schedule, and we'll only be serving a, uh, a breakfast from 7 to 9, and then from then on it will be appetizers and then the meal itself. And we'll have kind of pretty much the food all throughout the day set out so that you can kind of come back and snack whenever you like, have some leftovers. All right. Okay. Well, is there anything else I can help you with? No? Okay. Well, like I said, um, if you need anything, just dial zero on the phone and I'll be more than happy to help you. We also take uh, your clothes to be laundered and dry cleaned as well, so if you need that, just let me know. Or if you need room service. And I'll leave the key here right on the table as I walk out, and uh, I hope you enjoy your stay here with us. Have a great Thanksgiving if I don't see you before then. Okay, wonderful.